Well, Montana has become the first state to ban TikTok over concerns about the app's ties to China. Now, those concerns are shared coast to coast. So will this law in Montana be a model for states like ours? WBZ's Laura Hayfley has some answers. For some, scrolling TikTok is just for fun. For others, it's a creative outlet and even financial stability. Social media influencers like Tommy Garino concerned after the governor of Montana signed legislation banning TikTok statewide. TikTok going away, that would really um, take away a big income stream. Other Boston influencers like Brittany DeCapua are worried the ban could make it to Massachusetts and have significant effects on users. TikTok, was a, it is a community. Um, people, when they felt lonely or that they had no one to talk to, went to TikTok to gain um, you know, affection in a way. Montana Governor Greg DeForte claims the bill addresses national security risks. And while U.S. lawmakers have questioned TikTok's CEO in the past about harmful content and foreign governments' access to U.S. citizens, the app says the ban is unconstitutional. TikTok spokesperson writing to WBZ in part, Governor John Forte has signed a bill that infringes on the First Amendment rights of the people of Montana. So what could a TikTok ban in Montana mean for Massachusetts? This kind of ban in Massachusetts would similarly fail to a constitutional challenge. Boston-based attorney Jennifer Roman claims the ban infringes on a person's right to free speech. The states have the ability to limit and restrict free speech if there is some sort of immediate threat. That's really hard to establish here when you're just making a blanket ban on an app that's used for a whole variety of communication reasons. Though Massachusetts State Representative Michael Soder claims there is an immediate threat, supporting the ban in part. Writing to WBZ, a total ban could trigger constitutional challenges that would be counterintuitive to the goal we are trying to accomplish here, protecting our government and our residents' sensitive data. TikTok tells WBZ they plan to fight the ban, joined by civil rights groups, including the ACLU. The ban will take effect in Montana January 1st. In Boston, Laura Hayfley, WBZ News.